Hey, welcome back, everybody. We are broadcasting live from Pompeii Park. So she is one of the best tennis players in the world. Her roots are actually right here. And in just about 24 hours, Coco Golf will be one of the flag bearers at the opening ceremony of the U.S. Olympics. It is one of the highest honors before the competition even really begins. This is actually one of the reasons this morning that we are here live in Pompeii Park in Delray Beach. This is where Coco really got her start. It's where she used to train. Right here, right where we are sitting. The star power at these courts, though, Bill Murray as well. He's been a fixture at Pompeii Park since the early 70s. We have more on the backstory on him, too. So Mr. Murray is the real deal. He coached Coco's dad as well, Corey, growing up. Um, he also had a hand in Venus and Serena Williams coaching them. He entered Coco into her first tournament when she was just seven years old for him. Uh, this is really about being able to tap into all of his players' confidence, he says. A good coach is a person who motivate the kid. They motivate the kid and, and tell the kid that, you know, uh, you got to do it, you know, it's not up to me. I tell them, you know, like, uh, always be positive and don't get mad. You don't want to get mad. So Murray, he knows these courts well. He grew up himself playing at Pompeii Park during segregation. He says this park really has always been a safe haven, especially for blacks dating back to the late 1940s. Tonight at 5 o'clock, we're going to dive even deeper into the archives for a look at some of the star power. I mean, star power that was discovered right here over the last 80 years. We actually just had Taylor Townsend's mom drop by. Taylor, mind you, also trained on these courts. I mean, the star power. Yeah. If these courts could talk, tell the stories of just the legends yeah. that have trained here. Wow.